Mates, we've got a massive tide today in Cairns and a super low tide, 0.1 meters. And that's awesome because it means I can fish one of my favorite spots. It's this one place where the reef is really close to shore and on these super low tides, you can walk out onto it and fish this little lagoon. And I love it because you can catch anything in there, like all your estuary species, jacks, barra, finger mark, and then queenies, trevs, normal stuff. Also reef fish too. I've caught a good tusk fish, coral trout, just about anything I reckon. And that's why I like it. It's windy as today, but you only get these tides a couple of times a year. So I'm gonna go anyway, wish me luck. Seriously, so windy. Only an idiot would be fishing this spot today. I didn't bring copper shoes. These are useless for walking in the mud. So I've just come out to this little bommie, just so I can at least have the wind at my back a bit when I cast, or at least to my side. It's a bit treacherous though, because there's all these rocks in front of me. Might see if I can move a bit further to the right. What is it? Oh no, a grunter. Yuck. Spikiest fish in the world. Don't want your hands anywhere near it. Oh, yep. Yeah. Oh. That was a decent whack. Massive sea urchin. How's all this soft coral? This is epic. Oh, something's having a whack at it. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, that's all right. That's actually a good fish. Jesus. Ugh. Oh, it's Trevally. I think. Yeah, it is. Oh, it's a nice golden. That's why I was just sucking at it. I sort of plucked it. There we go, that's a decent fish, a lovely golden trevally. Off he goes. Yep. Another decent fish. Something different, I think. Silver still. Valley, yeah. Not a golden. GT, I think. Yeah, GT. Just a little one. Beautiful little GT. Tiny. Still pulled all right, though. Yep. Oh, shit, that's big. Oh. Damn, that was a good one. That felt different. It's just sort of big and heavy. Damn, that could have been a good reef here. There's a few fish out there now. Hopefully, oh, as soon as it hit the water, yeah. Definitely a few fish out there. That's a Chevalier again. Not very big. Oh no, this is a queen fish this time. It's three and four casts. Fish are on, I reckon. This one in the side, so it's gonna pull a bit harder, I think. Oh, it's a bit bigger actually, as well. Queenfish, I think. Oh, shit, he's nearly got. Nah, he's fair hooked. Oh, he's going. It's about the same size as the other, just fair hooked him. Spiky little things, these queenfish. Off we go. Wrong way, my friend. That way. There you go. wind has turned. Oh, there's fish busting up just where I cast. It is so windy right now. I've got the wind in my back now though, which is good, but it's pretty miserable. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, there we go. 
Sorry, yeah. It's so windy. It's a little GT. Just a little fella again. Yeah. That's still uh, probably a little GT, I think. They're all about the same size, these GTs, but there are bigger Trevally in here. Little fish it just spewed up. Some little colourful reef fish. Cool. Yeah. Another GT. Yeah. Little Trevally again, I think. Looks pretty deep in here. It is not shallow at all. Really should have taken my jumper off. Fuck. No wonder there's so many fish in here. It's just a big deep channel. Fuck. Big bummy. This sucks. And I got it. I hope there's no tiger sharks in here. Or crocodiles. lost my drone. Oh, it's over this way somewhere. I flew it too far and it wouldn't come back to me. And it's about to die. And I don't know where it is. Dangerous situation. Tide's coming in. I've left all my shit on the rocks. I'm miles away from all my gear now. Oh, I can see it. Now I gotta go get my gear. Hope it's dry. Jeez, look how close my rod was to the water. All right, I gotta get out of here. Otherwise I'm gonna get stuck. That water's coming in fast now. Looks like there's a pretty serious storm about to hit. I'm not gonna stay much longer. I don't wanna be stuck in that. Fuck! That storm just absolutely hit out of nowhere. I thought I had like a good half an hour of fishing time left and all of a sudden it was just on me. I'm just gonna wait in the car for a bit because I don't reckon it'll hang around long. It's freezing though, like you would not know it's North Queensland. All right, rain stopped. Still windy as shit, but I'm gonna get back out there. So I've just switched to a surface lure. The lure I caught all the fish on was a Duo Realis Minnow, 80 millimeter. I've just switched to a Baste Sugar Pen. And my outfit is a two to five kilo stick, 2,500 Luvias. Braid is 0.6 PE Tasline. It's about 10, 12 pound and 12 pound liter. And that's the lure that's done all the damage. It's a Duo Realis Minnow, 80 millimeter with upgraded decoy trebles. They're YS81s, size eights. Conditions are absolutely beautiful now. There's no fish though. Haven't had a bite in ages. All right, I'm freezing. There's no fish. I reckon there's another storm about to hit. That was pretty devo. I thought I was gonna be on there, but there's another big tide tomorrow. I think I might have to come back. I'm back. It's still windy as shit, but it's sunny. How good is this? Tide is still too low to walk out onto the reef, but I'll have a flick, kill some time. I still get fish off the mud flats. I didn't yesterday, but I often do. Let's see how we go. Oh, that was a big fish. See that? How'd the GoPro pick that up? That was big. I'm guessing it's a big Trevally Queenfish. Is it still there? Come on. That was quite big. If you're walking through mud and sand and stirring up the bottom, it's always worth having a cast back towards where you've walked and stirred everything up because Trevally's and Queenies and things, they'll come and investigate. 
they'll follow around like stingrays and shovel nose that are stirring up the bottom. I've caught lots of fish doing that. Walk along a bit, kick up the mud and then cast back the way you came. All right, that tide's dropped now. Seriously, it took about 10 minutes. Tide's pumping. I'm gonna go out on that reef. I was catching all those fish yesterday. Oh, they're still in there. Yep. Yep, they're definitely still in there. That took all of one cast. Fairly small though. Little Trev. Good start. Cooter has the teeth on him. Oh, that's a hit. Yeah, I'm on. A little fish again. Oh, he's got yeah, Trevally. I think I have foul hooked him. Another little fella. Feels all right, that's bigger for sure. Okay, just lift it, oh, pulled the hooks, damn. That was bigger. Yep. Really small. That's bigger, that's definitely bigger. Oh yeah, I'm in a bit of trouble here. Oh, it's Trevally, I foul hooked it. It is bigger, not heaps bigger. It's not that big. Hooked it in the side, I think. Oh, it's a queenie. Yeah. So many fish out there, they're just all stacked up. Another little queen. That wind's really picking up. This is what happened yesterday. Score, oh, as he hit. Yeah, oh, missed it. Yeah, yesterday, yeah, yeah. Small. Big school of queenies out there now. They're not very big. Round number three or four, I think. Yep. You're free, my friend. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, yep. Oh, uh, Trevally. All right, I'm a little sick of catching small queens and trevs. I'm gonna go for a bit of a wonder. I wanna catch some briefies. That is a beautiful fish. That is very cool. Back you go, my friend. All right, tide's coming in. I think I might get out of here. Thanks for watching. 
wasn't the best couple of sessions I've ever had. Didn't really catch a big fish, except for that ray. That was cool. Bit of a fluke, I think, but I'll see you next time.